everyone, it's Beachy Nails. Today I have the Bundle Monster Binder review for you. How many of you have binders looking like this to store your plates? We have all their plates and all these pages. The thickness between that compared to this. Look at the size. I prefer these much better. Come something looking like this. Padded envelope. It holds 168 image plates. There's slots at the top right here where you slide your plate in. And then you have to slide it on the front cover to get it for the back side too. It's one thing that's a pain, but you know, they're new, they have to be stretched out a little bit. After you get all your plates in it, it's fine. How heavy is it or how thick once you get all your sets in there? Well, here's another one that I have. I have two. This is brand new, nothing's in it. This one has three sets. Bundle Monster 1, 2, and 3 already in it. Not that much of a difference. Let me show you. closed. The set's in there. You can still see six at a time. Twelve on a sheet. These are all three sets I have. That is the halfway mark. I have all these pages still to fill. Would you rather have something fashionable, compact, easy to carry? Everybody wants to know, do your plates slide around? They're going to a little bit. I mean, I can pick it up sideways. It'll be fine. Upside down, I'm squeezing it. It's okay. They're still in there. Unlike the binder. I'm not going to tip it upside down. You guys know that. You have to carry it one way, one way only, facing you. My daughter carried it one time this way and all of them everywhere. What a pain. So is it something would I buy again? Definitely. Like I said, I have two of them. These are great, fashionable, kind of like a crocodile. Says Bundle Monster right there even. They're very cute. I'd rather have these all sitting next to my chair in the living room, look at them, kind of like reading a book. That's what I do, study my plates, get ready for my next Manny. Thank you for stopping by.